And while the trial of former Minneapolis police officer Derek Chauvin continues, Orlando Police is welcoming 16 new officers to the department. Chief Orlando Rallone says their diverse background will better serve the community. News 6's Ezzy Castro introduces us to some of those new officers. The Orlando Police Department just sworn in 16 new officers and this recruit class of 2021 is not only training on how to protect the community, but also how to connect with residents. Don't be hesitant or nervous or anything just because I have a badge on. Officer Jade Rhodes is part of Orlando Police Department's recruiting class of 2021. She was chosen out of thousands of candidates to join the agency and says she's ready to serve and protect now more than ever. When people ask like why I chose this profession or you know why are you doing it during this time right now? My mom asked me the same question every single day and it's I can't tell you, I can't explain to you, it's a feeling inside me. The department says this recruiting class is diverse. 18% are African American, 18% are female, and 25% are Hispanic. And diversity is something Officer Ezekiel DeVos says is extremely important in our community, which is why he wants to interact more with the people of Orlando once he hits the ground running. Orlando is a very uh, diverse community. Uh, a lot of people in and out of the city um, traveling and uh, not only just the residents, but a lot of international people coming in and out of the city. Um, so I, I really enjoy interacting with different people. Officer Baylor Anderson worked for the Department of Children and Families for years and says her goal was to be in this uniform to help even more kids. I think bringing that to the patrol aspect of, you know, interacting with kids on a day-to-day -day basis. One of my coworkers was saying, you know, just playing basketball with kids on the street is something that is just a simple interaction but can make the biggest difference. And the officers will now have to go through a supervised field training for the next couple of months before they go patrolling on their own. In Orlando, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.